everyone in this room, you're actually scholars of the Confederacy. And I feel the problem comes in when people want to support that flag for reasons they don't even know. They don't know of any of the conflicts, any of the, the blood that was really shed. They don't so, know they understand. They don't understand. Here's another thing. You just, Pardon me? Here's another thing. You just mentioned the stars and bars. Mm -hmm. And that's? That's the stars and bars. It's, it's not the... It's not, not the Confederate. It's, it's not the St. Andrew's Cross. Mm -hmm. And see, and, and people... People don't know. Yeah. And so that's why I'm very honored to be here with people. You're, this is actually the history of, of our nation. Yeah. And it was brother against brother. So yeah. In we're, some cases, father against son. Mm -hmm. yeah, it's it's really fascinating history. Yeah, it is. <laughs> and look at us, descendants of everyone, and we're all here. Yeah. yeah it's, it's so good to see you here. Yeah. I would like that. Thank you. And it's, what a wonderful project you have. Yeah, they're boys, they're boys from uh, Mr. Bates, thank you so much. Yeah, thank you for doing what you did. By the way, a lot of people don't know it, but in this organization, nationwide, if anyone says anything of a derogatory nature about black people, it's grounds for immediate dismissal. Mm -hmm. Did you know that? No, I didn't. Oh, Most yeah. of them consider as a matter of states' rights, mm -hmm. all of our people, my people, these were desperately poor people from the Appalachian Mountains. They wouldn't have known a, a slave if they'd seen one. Mm -hmm. They were slaves, mm -hmm. if anything. It's all in the movie. <laughs> I was interviewed by a guy who does Valley Veteran News, and his father was also a Pearl Harbor survivor, so he invited me to be on his TV show, and Marlene was the camera, video, everything in the world except the interviewer. Marlene read the story and was so taken with my dad's Pearl Harbor story that she made the video. And that's the poster she made to go with the video. Very nice. Super. And that was the first one that she had ever done alone really? by herself, yes. Wow. So. I'm better now. She's better now. <laughs> She's, uh, very well done, very well done. Yeah. that inspired me. I couldn't put the story down, which isn't just a story, but actually someone's life that affected all of us. And I appreciate all of my service people in every conflict we've ever had in our nation. to Mr. Waldron, which unfortunately he never received. Um, basically, it says, Edward Hugh Waldron Jr. has been elected a member of General Tyree Harris Bell Camp, number 1804, sons of Confederate veterans. Upon the record of his Confederate ancestor, First Sergeant John Waldron, Company C, 34th Virginia Infantry, and his membership card is also here. So I'd like to give you that. I wish I could have buried this with him. Oh, yeah. Sure, and I also... I did bury him with a oh. mason jar of moonshine, though. Ah, ah, very good. good. Very good. <laughs> That's very good. Yeah. And this is the elusive World War II medal that we were able to finally procure from the National. Oh my God, that's awesome. So it's very nice. It's a ribbon, a pin, and it also says World War II underneath. Wow. So that would have been nice to be able to put it. But he's looking down. He knows he's getting it. And this is a certificate. 
right here from the Sons of Confederate Veterans honoring a World War II veteran. And it says, Sons of Confederate Veterans War Service Medal is presented to Edwin Hugh Waldron Jr. for honorable service in our nation's military service during a time of war. This medal is presented for his service in World War II. Presented this 5th day of August in the year 2016, Commander-in-Chief Thomas B. Strain. Oh. He would be very proud. I think so. He is very proud. Yes, he's, he's looking down. Right? I also am a daughter of the Confederacy. I'm, I'm in under the same ancestry. Very good. Very nice. <laughs> Thank you very much. You're welcome. Yeah, that medal is very nice. She also is a member of Daughters of the American Revolution and does genealogy for all of the people trying to improve their ancestors and everything else. So, uh, And she loves doing genealogy. If anybody is interested, she would be more than happy to help someone out if they're looking for other um, people to go in on or anything else. Miners' lives matter. <laughs> <laughs> oh, sure. You want me to hold it up? And, okay. And I was going to give it to Patty. Her mother was also in the Navy. She was one of the first My, waves. Wow. Yeah, you have a very uh, honored uh, military family. My mother here. had a top secret clearance and one of the very oh, wow. first women in the Navy. Wow. Have you come back to Harvard? 